hard as you can. I mean, <laughs> Can we, play, can we play next game, one game? Okay guys, there is two brackets here. There's one that is good, it's works pretty well, and there's one that is terrible right here. You know what? I'm gonna be happy with the bad one. <laughs> A few moments later. We are here live with Ali Al Ghashami, who just got smacked in table tennis. Me? Ali Al Ghashami, a few questions here. First of all, you've obviously been retired, looks like maybe about 15, 20 years now. Um, obviously, your muscles, legs don't work the same way they do. Is, is, there, is that the reason for your loss in uh, table tennis today? Well, uh, I have to say that uh, I, I kind of lost confidence, you know, the last couple of games. It's been tough on me. Uh, but you know, it's it's just trying, you know, I'm trying to make just trying to make my best, you know. It's, it's so you don't you don't credit any of the uh, any of the game to Javi's talent and Javi's extreme ability at tennis, table tennis. To be completely honest, Coach Bautista is a terrible trainer. I mean, he hasn't brought anything to the table. <laughs> this is when you know you've been retired for a long time and you've just given up on life. That is correct. ice cream. No shame. No shame. Quick fact, did you know, this guy right here, this guy right there, was in FIFA. You can actually play with him in FIFA, what was it, FIFA 1995 or 19... FIFA 2010. FIFA 2010. So if you have a copy of FIFA 2010, IK Star... In Stark? the top division in Norway. In the top division in Norway. And just let me know when you make it a FIFA game, and when you do that, we'll have a conversation, all right? Can't That's... connect the 10 yard pass though, but he gets in FIFA. Can't connect the 10 yard pass. This is the idea though, like, that passing lane is perfect. See? Boom. There's so much space. Um, someone else needs to be under. Christina, you've checked, you, you're the first center mid coming to check into the ball, right? So you don't get the ball, but you get wide and you create that passing lane preferred. So you wouldn't, realistically, you're not going to be able to get underneath within time. So she might be able to get underneath. And Ferg's... <laughs> So, next part of Coach Javi's busy day. Some individual sessions with a few of our players and I'll wear the GoPro and in this video I'll put in some of the coaching points so you can see what I tell them during the individual sessions. Stop filming yourself! Stop doing selfies! <laughs> That's one of the girls. And um, so I wanna, I wanna continue doing the individual training videos and all that. So I know I've been doing a lot of um, videos on other stuff, vlogs and all that, but Rest assured, Coach Javi will not get away from his roots. So, got four girls coming out, so it should be a good session. Oh, and by the way, the boots, mate. Everyone asks me, what type of boots are the ones that you use in your Sunday league? These were $20 at the flea market. Yep. Coach Javi paid 20 bucks for these bad boys. They're the uh, Tiempos, they're the black and teal ones, but I just Sharpie the, the teal logo to make them all black. Yep, there you go. All right, off to the session.
Hey people go This particular time Was extra special And though you might be gone And the world may not know Still to see you Celestio You girls get to decide when you want to switch and when you want to move. As soon as this happens, and I notice this, she plays the ball. Get out, get out, Jordan, get out, get out. Yep, good. See what I'm saying? But you guys get the idea. So take a little bit of a risk. I'd rather you do that and the ball goes far than too soft in the middle and then it gets intercepted and now we're trying to prevent a counter attack. Okay, all right, off we go. And again, this is what it would look like. I'm away, I'm away, she plays it back. She's facing, yes, 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 yes. Nope, play there, good. Now I pop in underneath and now I'm here. Get what I'm saying? So we get away, we check to to create that space, drag the defender with us, and then when she plays this ball, then you pop in underneath, okay? What a legend. Whoa, look at that legend right there. Who's that guy? There's the other legend right there. Hook! One and only. <laughs> Where are you guys headed this weekend? Cincinnati. First game of the season. Norway, Norway, Norway. Chile. Norway. Chile. <laughs> slash Norway. 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 Poland, I mean Germany. Norway. Canada. 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 America, baby. America, baby. <laughs> yeah, they, put, hey, they put all the Americans in the back, is that what it's come to? They put all the Americans in the back now. Alright boys, good luck at uh, good luck at Cincinnati. Take it easy boys. Alright, so Coach Javi cannot go to Cincy because the women play against Maryland at home. So while they're off going to Ohio, we'll be here playing against Maryland. So that's why I can't go to that game, but hopefully they get the three points and hopefully we get the three points as well. Two big games this weekend. So earlier you guys saw a time lapse of the film and how we watch film. Stina's here, legend, and uh, we're actually gonna break it down and show you guys basically how we use it to prepare for the upcoming match. So this is what we do. We have a website called Right Play, and um, what we do is we code the film for every single position. So if you can see there, we have forward opportunities, defensive situations, goals, goals against, defensive corners, all that stuff and then the numbers are the position so the number three is our left back number four is our left center back and we code it so that every time they're involved we mark it down so for example Stina or the attacking mid so we code her as zero we code it for her and then all we have to do is just play it and it'll give us just the clips in which Stina was involved every time she was involved in the play Stina will pop up there so that's how we code it and then when she comes in, all I have to do is play her part, or if she wants to watch certain other parts of it, we can watch those as well. So, yeah, it's pretty, uh, pretty crazy. Look at all that coding that we have to do, and that's that's something we do for every single game. So that was good because I'm fine with a few quick little passes like that as long as we realize when we have to switch it eventually. Calis look, even if you look at Callista's movement here, uh, look at that yeah, she gets away because she knows it. She gets away, she gets away, she gets away. These two girls are pressing, and that's the, those are the only two girls pressing from their team. And now it opens up a huge passing lane in there for Callista. Boom. Look at how much space she's got. So Callista does well to recognize that. I'm fine if we connect a few passes on the same side as long as eventually we realize we have to switch it. patience we, we got very impatient we got very impatient and we stopped trying to play we just think that the faster we can get it forward the more chances we have when in reality the faster we go forward sometimes causes us to just keep losing the ball over and over and if there's never any flow if we can never get any anything going then it's just gonna be pointless because then it's just boot ball mm -hmm. so it's like especially especially in a game like this how hot was it like 95 Something like that. Especially in a game like this where it's going to be extremely hot, we need to let the ball move. We need to get our energy when, when we're on the ball. If we just keep playing boot ball, we're just going to be chasing. We're going to get a lot more tired than as if 
then if we just try and keep it. Just keep it, keep it, keep it. And even from certain situations, you can tell those spaces will open up. And if we move the ball, those spaces will open up. We're just impatient. We're just impatient and we want to go forward right away. And it's just boot ball. <laughs>